probably the strongest painkiller you're going to find out here in the woods. And I'm going to show you how to make a tincture with it. Ghost pipe or Indian pipe. This mysterious ghostly perennial plant is white because it doesn't have chlorophyll and cannot photosynthesize like other plants. It's a parasitic plant that gets its nutrients from fungi. So you would forage them like you would mushrooms because most of the time they grow together. It's a sedative and a nervine so it calms the nervous system. It's a great pain reliever and is said to calm your mind as well. The Native Americans used this for all kinds of ailments. They're pretty rare in some areas but somehow I have a lot of them growing right behind the house. And you want to harvest it sustainably by only picking one or two from each cluster. You can eat small amounts. It has a bitter, spicy taste. Wow, stronger than I remember. I can definitely feel a numbing effect in my mouth, kind of like Novocaine. It's a very powerful plant, which also contains some toxins, but it's okay to use in small amounts. So just use it with caution. You can also make a tincture with it. I use 40% 80 proof vodka. Do this in the field and add them to the alcohol as soon as you pick them. Just enough to submerge them. I'll let it sit for about six weeks in a cool, dry, dark place. After that, you strain it and then only use a few drops at a time because it's very powerful stuff. It should turn purple when it's done.